so uh, our viewers have been complaining that it's been about a year and we haven't put a bumper on the car yet. Well, just let me pull it out of storage. We're here at my storage unit. So I can show you the condition of the bumper and maybe as to why we haven't done it. Well, yeah, um, let's see. Let's see what it's like. Uh, it's pretty bad. Yeah. All right, cool. Here's the other shit that I have in storage. Wheels for the S3. What else? Those are the wheels for the V5. What else do I have? Oil. Yeah. This one's empty. Wonder where it went. The S3. What? <laughs> it's gonna break. It's gonna break. <laughs> it's gonna break. It's gonna break. Alright, so okay. obviously. Bumper. Okay, let's just load it up. We'll do other stuff later. Where's the headlight? You don't have the headlight here. It's here. You want a oh, calendar? Oh, oh. I'm gonna count those in my trunk. 2013. Yeah, 2000. Ah, 2013. Nostalgia, baby. 2013. You're, you're a little late on that one. Yeah, that's why. I'm It'll take what about 10 years for it to catch up, <laughs> or something like that. You gonna run spacers? Here's actually, the CS flush kit from the S3, 10 mil front, 17 and a half mil rear. Actually, are those five by 100 by any chance? I think they're dual purpose. Can I have them? For what? <laughs> for 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 the one I can't talk about. Oh, for your future build? Yeah. For an actual build, not a. Yeah, not a just a tune and. Not a brand new car. We're just gonna slap parts on. Yeah. Dicks. <laughs> Bunch of fucking dicks. Where are your videos at? The internet is a cruel, cruel world. A cruel mistress. It is. I should hang this calendar. You should. It'll be the, 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 the... Go back in time. So... Um, you got the whole headlight? Yeah, all I needed was oh, the but ballast. It's, it's busted. But the headlight is busted. <clears throat> but there could be some good parts in this. Yeah. Uh, I visited my good friend Woody, who I bought the car from, and uh, he hooked me up with the whole headlight. So, we should be back on the road in no time. I'm assuming... I think these ballasts work left to right. We're gonna find out. Oh wait, what? They, they, they work. Yeah, because I see people sell them on the B5 all the time. Yeah. Okay. The other. So, I have a headlight. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm gonna get So, uh, yeah, we're gonna borrow some tools from, uh, from my girlfriend. That's right. I don't own shit. I don't even own a fucking screwdriver. No, actually, I do own a screwdriver. There's one inside the S3. They give it to you from factory. Thanks, Audi. I have a ton of tools, but they're actually in Miami. And yeah, I moved to Austin, and my parents have all my tools. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, it kind of sucks. But I don't have the space to work on the car, so it doesn't really matter. So, what are we taking? E torque bits. <laughs> Oh, English books. Oh no, service manuals. Subaru, dude. Subaru, dude. <laughs> More to come. <laughs> yeah, we're throwing a uh, a Subaru. What, 2.5? <laughs> we'll put an EJ205 in this car, or in the B5. Why not? Yeah, cause that'll that'll go over well in, on the internet. Just like the LS1, the B5, or the LS1 Subaru. People hate those things. <coughs> purists. Damn those purists. <laughs> it's fucking cold. It's hard plastic's hard as hell right now. Because I just don't know how to open it. Oh, huh. <laughs> it's all it takes. 
<laughs> That's why you don't own a set of tools. Own tools I'm a fucking tool. Alright, torques acquired. Cool. Piece the car. It's a Mark IV. I don't want it to break into it. Right here. So we do need to pull the headlight off because we need to change out the ballast. But really what we want to do is we want to fit the bumper and see if it works because we haven't had the bumper on the car since really we got it. I mean we took the bumper off the second we got the car because it was falling off. So I mean it won't hopefully fall off when we drive in traffic. Um, if it does then um, for all of our viewers that commented that we needed to put the bumper on. We'll start a GoFundMe. Yeah you, you fuckers will basically buy us a bumper. All right, I don't know what bit to use. For, uh, oh, dude. I don't know if, uh, did you see what this has? What are they? Weird. Oh, fuck. Those look Y'all have fit. to take that? Yeah. Those are hollow um, yeah. Torx. I don't know what a hollow Torx is. Yeah. Oh, so I don't have the right bits. Yeah, you need the female type, not the male type. Think of it like that. Oh, they did that on purpose. Thanks, Audi. You don't have a lot of luck with headlights, do you? No, I don't fuck with headlights anymore. After what? The R32. I uh, I blew the igniters on both sides, and then I took it into the insurance company and said, "Hey, I don't know what happened. The uh, the headlights just stopped working." So, hundred dollar claim later. Got new fucking igniters. Saved myself three hundred bucks. It was great. Insurance, kids. It's lovely. Gloves would also be lovely, but you know what? This is Texas, and who the fuck owns winter gloves? For those needing to remove a ballast from a headlight, the correct tool to use is a T20 female security Torx bit. We picked a setup with different sizes for about 6 bucks at Harbor Freight Tools. A link to the tool will be in the description. Let's see what else we can botch. So what are we doing? Alright, so we're swapping out this mirror. Um... Which is the regular mirror, right? Just, you know, boom, bye. We're swapping out this bad boy that just auto dims, I believe, uh, for a mirror from a B6 S4. This one has compass, and it's uh, not fucked up. Our original mirror that we had in the car was, um, you know, when auto dimming mirrors break, and they basically turn purple. Well, that's what happened to the mirror. So um, these side mirrors, the driver side mirror is purple in this car. So. Passenger side luckily isn't, but the driver side needs to get changed out. So, this actually belongs to one of Al's customers. So, it's got to go back to that person. And uh, here's our new replacement mirror. So, ideally, we want to put this mirror with compass and brand new functioning mirror on the car. These should be straight bolt up swaps, um, but we have a little bit of an issue with the current mounting point that is um, basically right here on our car. We gotta get this off because this mirror has, um, I think it already has one on it. So we need to basically pull that off to put this on there. Well, let's car. figure it out on this one. Okay, yeah, it looks like it does because we yeah, have that. Yeah, because this one's got a big gaping mm -hmm. hole in it because the mounting point's on the window. Okay, cool. So, yeah. So, how are we gonna do this? Because uh, it's kind of cold and. Um, do you believe in magic? I guess. Cool. Magic Johnson? Unless you can twist that off of that one and just reuse that mounting point. Oh, I see what you're saying. Take this point off of this mirror and just use the one that's on the fucking car. That makes total sense. If we can. And these are plug and play. There's already a wire connected here. The wire is essentially for auto dimming, but this wire should also use should also work for compass. <clears throat> so, ideally, this is a straight swap. That's what everybody does in these cars. Audi makes it to where they interchange things, so this should work. Bought this from somebody on B5S4 Facebook group. I don't know if it was uppercase or lowercase group. I don't, I don't remember, but yeah. So this going to be a better driving experience. So you know the term hot boxing? Oh my god. Yeah, except that this is with uh, carbon Why monoxide. Oh. oh, hey, look, it works 100 degrees. Liar. <laughs> you <laughs> fucking liar. <laughs> fucking liar. <laughs> East. Are we facing east? Oh bullshit, this thing ain't calibrated. We're facing oh, north. Oh shit, we are? <laughs> Son of a bitch. So. Oh, It'll crap. fix itself. It'll fix itself. I you guess. Just, just gotta just gotta do some donuts, man. That's right. That's all. 
We need some snow first. I don't want to fuck up my shit anymore. It's already fucked up. We have a sunroof, but we're never gonna open it. Yeah, I don't. Because it will probably never close again. Yeah, I um, don't. And uh, Texas rain is no joke. Texas rain can be pretty brutal. Hey, look, there I am. So yeah, so we just gotta get that mount off. But it's good. It works. It works. Cool. All right, cool. So this bumper needs to be fixed. I mean, shit, it needs to be plastic welded. Or riveted. Riveted. I mean, like, it's in shambles. Yeah, it's fucking broken here. It's, looks like it's already been fixed, but broken here. <clears throat> I don't know. So we don't shit. have any screws to put it on the car? No, it's going to be held on by hopes and dreams, blood, sweat, and tears of the V5 S4 group. Dude. Well, folks, sometimes things just don't work out as expected. Our advice, research the needed tools before tackling a mini project. Stay tuned for more Project V5.